Oscar, just tell us about uh, your, your takeaways from the Dubai Sevens and uh, what you guys are looking to improve going into Cape Town. I think the takeaways from personal note are uh, just to, to do what I do. And if I know if I, can, if I have the ball and I, and I just make sure that my teammates is always, I put them always in, in space and they score a try, not me. And I know that's something good for the team. And I just think this weekend is going to go just about basics. If you can do the basics right against Zimbabwe, just put them away next game. We must focus on all the small things. And I think the most important thing is, is, is celebrate the small victories. If someone gets a big hit, you go up to him, you give him a high five, good scrum. All the small things is going to gonna create energy for, for the build-up to the semi-finals, the quarters, our last pool game against New Zealand. All the small things to go forward. We must take it game by game. And then I know this team, this team can do something special this weekend. Yeah, and Coach Neil spoke a bit about the discipline and defence needing to improve. How do you guys rectify that in a week? I think, as I was saying, if if you make sure you your one on one hits is there, then we we won't get into position where we six guys on the field. Then no one's going to do something silly uh, like go over their feet, high tackle, all that small stuff. If we can just do the basics right this weekend, then. We won't be in that situation again. Yeah. I mean, you uh, played off the bench uh, predominantly in Dubai. What was the thinking behind that, and what is your role in the team that's been defined uh, for the new season? The role in the team for me being on the bench, you get a guy like Branko is there. He's more like, how can I say it? I always said he's like a, a Patrick Lambie for me. He's always calm. He's always, he would just do the right things at the right time. As you can see, when you have confidence, he can kick the ball out of the corners, and that's something special. And that's like for me saying, now nah, that guy's doing a good job. And my job from the bench just make sure I come with energy and I just take the game to the next level, like putting guys into space, just pick up the game because sometimes they will be tight second half. And that's one thing me and the coach were speaking about. Like, I think if I can come on second half and just love the energy, make sure the guys in the right, get the defense, everything sorted, and the gaps will open and I will set the guys away. Yeah, Roscoe, just a final one, looking at your future, uh, will this be the final tournament before you join the Bulls, and what are your your plans going forward in terms of the 15s game? Uh, I think that's going to be a sad one, but I think I will just take the positive out of this one. I think this will be my last one for the blitz box, and uh, it will be like Saturday or Sunday, the last one when you have to say goodbye to the guys, but because we've been together for three years, four to five years now, and I think I've learned a lot from the sevens, my skills, small things that you don't pick up on 15 men, and I think I will just enjoy my, myself this weekend, and with the Bulls, I'm, I'm excited for this this new journey ahead. All right, great. Thanks, Roscoe. Thank you, man. Cheers. Have Cheers. A good